chest those tired of sailing on their own finally rest inside the shadow cast by Calvary's love across their souls. Calvary's love, Calvary's love, priceless gift, Christ makes us worthy of. The deepest sin can't rise above. has crushed and cast aside and redeemed till heaven's promise fills with joy one's empty eyes so desire to tell the story of a love that loved enough to die burns away all other passions and fed by Calvary's love becomes a fire gift Christ makes us worthy of the deepest sin can't rise above Calvary's love Calvary's love has never Faltered all its wonders still remain. Souls will take eternal passage, sins atone, and heaven gain. Sins atone. Brethren, are you feeling sad, feeling unloved, and feeling hopeless? Are you feeling bombarded with lots of things? We have a Father in heaven who is always there for us. He is a God of love. And we, as His children, we must be reflecting the love that God shows us. If you ever feel that you are being hated, being alone in this world, I would want you to please stand up and accept the love that God gives us. God says in the song that Calvary's love is something that is priceless. And when you receive something that is priceless, it would be generous for you to share it with others. So for the start of this week of prayer, may we feel God's love throughout the week and may the love that we will feel may reflect in our lives and others will see it 
and do likewise. In our world that is full of chaos, I would like each and every one of us to be instruments of God so that others may see what true love really means. Shall we pray? Father in heaven, as you can see, your children are standing here before you. Father, we are willing to accept your love that you will help us to be instruments so that others may see it within us. Father, we are tired of this world. Our world hungers for true love. Father, may you grant us with a love. And as we enter more and more into your love, may we be reflecting it each and every day of our lives. We are willing, Lord, to accept the love that you have given for free. Thank you for the assurance that you will be always with us no matter how tired, how hopeless, and how everything seems to fall apart. Father, we rely and depend on you more. Father, thank you. Because of you, we are still here, gathered and praising your name. All these things we ask in the loving name of Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. Amen. For a closing song, let us all stand and sing our theme song. Let us all bow our heads as we pray. Almighty God in heaven, our loving Father, our Lord and Master Jesus Christ, our Savior yet our friend, our guide and comforter, the omnipotent Holy Spirit, Almighty Triune God, we humbly come before you this morning. 
Thank you for revealing yourself to us. We are finite, Father in heaven. We are limited in so many ways. Our, our understanding and knowledge of the universe is just a dot in the ocean of mysteries that we could hardly comprehend, which we call the universe. Father, you are far above and beyond all these things that we know. Yet, you have revealed yourself to us as a loving God. Thank you for reminding us about this fact this morning. May you be with us as we continue participating in this week of prayer. May we experience the refreshing light of the truth of your holy word. May you develop in our hearts the desire, Father in heaven, to feed, to meditate upon your words. We ask all these things. May your blessing be upon us and in a special way be with those who, who are leading and uh, taking a major part in this week of prayer. We ask all these things. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen.